put my city on the map, that's the plan. Rockin' shows, stackin' dough, that's the plan. If you ain't talkin' money, what the fuck you sayin'? Cause we ain't stoppin' till I hold fuckin' fans straight. What's going on, boys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're about to go over the best defense in Madden 23 and the best blitz in Madden 23. Drop a thumbs up on the video, fight the algorithm. Make sure that you hit that red subscribe button down below. It's free. Let's get into today's bang, 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 finger. So the play we're going to be going over is the dime one four out of the Miami Dolphins. OK, I like to have auto flip off because I want the blitz to always come from the left hand side. Now you can go down here to match and then everything else is set up. This is a situational blitz. OK, if they are running gun trips, you don't want to run this unless they need more than 15 yards. OK, I have a full scheme with the nickel defense and then mixing this in to get pressure on your opponent and to play max coverage and make him panic and throw an interception okay so we're gonna have our safeties in that linebacker right here on this side is where you're gonna want to have your best cornerback so we're just gonna put byron jones right there this guy's gonna be manned up this guy's gonna be manned up this guy's gonna be your blitzer okay and then you're gonna want to have pretty good safeties at the top now we're gonna be going over the DB steam. On offense, first we're gonna start off with an empty set. So we're just gonna do an empty set like this. And as you can see, my guys come into the box. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pinch our defensive line, left D-pad to the left and down. Then we're gonna press. Now I like to take this guy RB and I like to man him up with the tight end. I like to shade inside and over the top. And then we all set up. Make sure that you guess pass. You can do anything with this blitzing guy right here too. You can also go ahead and drop him into a zone to take away that quick read. I'm just gonna stand right here for a quick second and then move to the left. So once they hike the ball, I'm gonna come, move to the left and you can see super fast pressure he has to hurry up and know exactly where he's gonna throw the ball okay so pinch the defensive line down press is super fast now make your quick adjustments boom we all set up already now you can put this guy into a spy guest pass anything that you want to we're gonna hover come over across right here to these routes boom super fast pressure on the quarterback now they are missing the quarterback but they are getting super fast pressure Pinch your line, press, set it up super fast like this, put him into a spot if you want to, and guess pass. Now this time I'm gonna run off to the left and then back to the middle. So we're gonna come to the left, then back to the middle, boom. Super fast pressure. Okay, this is something that you're gonna wanna mix in. So if they're in a tight formation, this is what you wanna do. You wanna pinch, and then you'll take that RB, put him on the running back, and it'll be looking like this. Now, you might want to shade over the top outside for a corner route or anything like that, but I'm going to run out there to take away the corner route by trying to bump him. So we're going to try this with two controllers. I'm going to try to bump him at the line of scrimmage and boom, give enough time for the pass rush to get in. Look at that. A scoop and score. That's going to be a free seven points for you. You feel me? That's what it's all about. You don't even have to get the offense on the field when you sprinkle in this end. So if they go into tight, let's try it again. So we come over, we're gonna go to gun tight, we're gonna go to bench, okay? So we're gonna pinch the line, go like this, we're gonna man him up with the running back, and then I like the guest pass. So this time I'm gonna try to run out there, I'm gonna come a little further, and I'm gonna try to hit that uh, corner route. So we're gonna come bump that corner route real quick, boom, okay? So now you can see it takes longer for the corner routes to develop. So we're gonna look at that real quick. You can get yourself far out there and try to slow that corner route down before five yards. So that little bump is enough to knock him off his rope. My guys is able to recover and boom, perfect defense. I mean, he can throw this out route real fast right there, but it looks like we are underneath it at first. So he's gonna have to force a throw. He can try to step up in the pocket, but the running back is taken, okay? So this time we're gonna block the running back. 
So if you got your opponent blocking the running back, you're going to be in a good spot because then you're going to have less routes coming out. So this time we're going to block the running back, RB. Okay, so we're going to pinch line, do this. We're going to block the running back, and that guy on the running back is going to uh, drop, drop into a zone. So we're going to shade up, shade over outside. Make sure that you shade outside. Shade outside, do it two times, and we're going to try to bump that uh, speed over there. So we're going to come, try to bump him real quick, and boom. They pick up the blitz right there, but we got a lot of pressure and very good defense on the backside. Okay, so if you see that they are blocking the running back, that's when you want to just put more people into zones. So if we set our defense up, and they're showing us that they are blocking the running back, so if we go to bench, he's blocking the running back. That's one less person out there. So that means it's four routes, one less person out there. Okay, so you can't have a double blitz coming from both sides. Like this, you can come touch them, and now you're gonna get somebody free also, or you can put more people into zones, okay? So we're gonna set it up like this. If they are blocking the running back, so you can make it that you still get the pressure in there, but we're gonna block the running back right here, and now we can put more zone. So now we can go ahead and put RB into like a vert hook. We can go ahead and put LB into a hard flat over there and have them on 20, some adjustments that you can make. Okay, then I want to QB contain and guess pass. Okay, so they blocking the running back. Boom. So we're going to stay right here, see what route breaks open. And now we got great, great coverage. Look at that. Great coverage. Not as good pass rush, but we do have great coverage with a lot of people in coverage right there. So they block the running back. So they're going to pick up the blitz. Okay, but we got great coverage down the field. Shaded over the top. Boom. Okay, if you enjoyed the video, drop a thumbs up on the video. Now, for the past couple of days, I've been labbing offense, and I got a crazy offense. People that I've been facing been giving me good messages saying how OP my offense is. I'm gonna put little clips at the end of this video. If you enjoy it, run and go get the ebook right now. You're gonna be destroying zone, you're gonna be destroying man, and you're gonna have one play touchdowns. Uh huh.